Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Jade Cocoon. We just got some major merges, and things are looking pretty good right now. So why don't we go right ahead back into the spider forest and see if we could actually take care of business this time. I'm excited. Here we are. Ring of Stoning. Gee, I wonder what that does. I'll look it up anyway, though. Oh, it's use, of course. And I rearranged my inventory just for uh, ease. Releases a flesh to stone mist when broken. Causes body hardening, starting from the feet. That's such a terrifying way to go. My goodness. It's great that even in this dungeon, enemies are avoiding me. Well, here's a save point. What's this? A necklace of jewels. Oh, it's the spider warp. Awesome. I'll take it. Am I allowed to... Is this just a dead end screen, I think? Alright. This guy just has nothing to do with me. But I can go off this way to this, like, secret area. There's just an item I want to pick up real quickly. Oh, it's you? A flute, man! Give me a... Give me a... Give me... Give me... Give me... Give me... Give me... Give me... Give me, give me. Your head fell off. Gimme, gimme. Gimme something sharp, flute man. Show him how to ask politely. Oh my god. I mean, I guess I'll do it. Yay. Hmm. What's this? Oh, never mind. What do you want? I could ask about stuff. Calabas herb. That's Totiano's special herb. It's a se it's secret. It's me and his secret. Secrets are important. You're a flute man. Men never keep secrets, so Calabas even more secret. Great, thanks. And now for the bird man. I let him have it, so no Calabas. Totiano, my dad, he guard it. He greedy, but he got weakness for shiny. Talk to him. Okay, fair enough. Calabas, Totiano's secret. Toto Yamu got weakness for shiny, shiny. You talk to him. All right. Anyway, I, I really came here for this. A tablet pierced by a spear. Merging two. I don't even have merging one. Great music again. Minions that use poison are also resistant to it. So merging such a minion with another creates a poison-resistant beast. Same goes with sleep and flush of stone attacks. That's very useful. So even if you aren't interested in the attacks, you can develop resistances by merging that type of minion. That's pretty cool. I'll take it. Hmm. Oh, another guy. Oh, it's Toriyamu. Hey, you there. What, what, what are you doing there? This place not for man? Away, away, away with you. What's that there? Oh, my. A nice ring you have there. Won't you give it to me? Yes. This I think I actually have to do, because the, the minion fang I didn't have to do. Oh, how beautiful. Yes, what do you want? 
What is it? About the calabas. Calabas. That I have, but if some got sick, you don't say. Only Bubu come to your village. How dare it? The locusts of the apocalypse. Well, here is some ca ca calabas for the ring. But won't be enough. I know place where there is a lot. But I no tell you for free. Bring me more treasure. <laughs> what a pain. Only then shall I tell you where the Caliban lies. <laughs> Talk it over with your elders. Got the herb though. Yeah, bring me more treasure. But, ah, come on. The Divine Spirit Mammon. Uh, that was my name long ago. I was called Mammon, I think. That's right, I'm the Watchman of the Divine Tree. I guard against tricks from you humans. I was ordered by Elrim. Ah, how much longer must I live like this? I've been doing this without end for hundreds of years, and there's only trees as far as the eye could see. I long for treasure. Blast that Elrim, how arrogant he is. Ha, huh, he was Mammon. Kick an neck. Even hearing that name sickens me, don't tell me you know him. Oh, I'm getting it. You've heard of him, a Calabas from Kikinak, right? I've told him a thousand times, I'm really going to do something about that Yamo. It's Kikinak's fault that the farce has come to this, that p -p -p pervert Because of him, we were dragged into this fine mess. Yeah, because he said he fell in love with a human. Bring me more treasure. Alright. Follow me, I shall remove your shackles and cast them away. The act of Gehenna, or Jehenna. I didn't think it would just kick me out. I thought I was still going to be in the forest. That's kind of a nuisance, actually. But I will go back into the spider forest. Oh, so you found the forest people. Well, did they have any calibers? I expected as much. So they will tell you in exchange for treasure. Nevertheless, I do not expect Jibara to consent to such terms. I will speak with the chieftain himself. There is no time to waste. We need a decision now. We should go straight to the Hall of Judgment. Okay then. So we're not even done with the forest. The imprisonment. So you say you've ascertained the location of the Calabas? Do you speak the truth? And he really will tell you if you present him with a treasure? If Garai is correct when she says that the demon is the keeper of the forest, then I have a plan. that the demon of which we speak is the guardian of the divine tree, an incarnation of the forest god. The calabas must lie at the base of the divine tree, the source of all life. Simply retrieving calabas will be but a temporary solution for troubles like the recent attack. It would be wise to find the divine tree and then imprison it together with the god of the forest. Yeah, that'll score points and end well. If we could just offer some treasure, this would be an easier decision. But Jibara, I wonder about imprisoning the Divine Tree. Would we be forgiven for such sacrilege? Would that not bring about the second coming of the tragedy of Gehenna Pale? The path to destruction began long ago, well before the locusts attacked us. What is done cannot be undone, even if the Calabas does solve the problem at hand. It is only a matter of time until the land of Paral is swallowed up by the forest. Therefore, we should put an end to our bloody traditions. 
All that we do is for the future of the people of Cyrus. No, all the people of peril! Lord Chieftain, now is the time for a decision. You say that it is possible to change the fate of all the people of peril? My ancestors, the shamans of Gehenna Pug, imprisoned the forest and divided it into four. It follows that the imprisonment of a god is indeed possible. The knowledge of man opposes the powers of God, and thus the powers of nature. This is not sacrilege. In fact, it is the basic law of nature. Only the strong survive. We have long waited for this day to truly serve Cyrus. We must find the divine tree and evoke the powers of the talisman of imprisonment. I understand. Well, you have heard, Jabara. We have to thwart the menace of the demons if we are to live with the forest. Such sacrilege. This too may be the nature of the beasts of knowledge. We must take action. Son of the Lion of Parl, our fate is already in your hands. Champion's Belt, Capture Amulet, oh boy. Can't wait to go right back into the forest with this uncomfortable mission. I have heard many tales, but it seems that Mamon is as greedy as ever. He will never return to his spirit form acting like that. So, Divine Tree and the Shaman Jabara. How foolish she is. You cannot imprison the Divine Tree. Did you not see the ancient ruins in the forest? Ugh! That ghost of Gehenna Pale. What is she plotting? But. If the chieftain so ordered, then we must obey. And the shaman. Her ancestors were alchemists in the ancient kingdom. Her family line has always held the real power in Cyrus, working behind the figurehead image of the chieftains. They have infested the chieftain's families and all the villages of peril. Overconfidence in human intelligence is the trademark of we beasts of knowledge. But it is also fact that without the blessing of knowledge we cannot survive. I think it should be of us beasts of knowledge. Man is at times weak, and at times a violent beast. And I'm out. The decisions of the Hall of Judgment are absolute. But it may well be a bloody path which lies before you. You must tread very carefully. Into the forest we go. Now I'm getting a little more uncomfortable with this turn of events. I'll take a look at my valuables shortly. above. Capture amulet. Packing the essence of the act of Gehenna captures the divine tree, the earthly form of God, and the champion's belt for Parol's wrestling tournament brings back fond memories of Grotto's youth. How nice. Anyway, let's go. Let's hope I know which way I'm going. This place is pretty massive. Also, not that it's really necessary at this point, but I wonder if I can give away the Divine Tablet. Like, because I'm, I'm going the wrong way right now as far as getting to Tomoyama was concerned, but 
can I do the divine tablet thing, please? Maybe just to just for satisfaction, maybe. All right, I think I'm doing it right. I think I'm in the right location. So let's see if it even accepts it. What? The divine tree. What do you want with the baobab tree? Elrum. I can't even do the divine tablet anymore. Well, <laughs> that's kind of a shame. I mean, I know it's just for information that I don't really need, but it would have been nice to be able to just give it away. Oh well, bye. I guess. Now how do I get back to where I was? The spider warp would be useful, but I don't know where the entryway spider warp is, so oh well? Oh, that's right, I did get south out of here. This place goes full circle. Guess I'm fighting this guy, though, because he's kind of aiming at me. Let's bring out my air type, please. Thank you. Basic wind attack, please. Very good, very good. I got the stone effect. Let's see if I can finish this quickly. Man, that stone works wonders, let me tell you. And you got a critical on me? I'm out of here. I'll use my water type even though it's inherently weak against this guy. Just get a couple of good shots in. That's all I need. Attack is neutral damage anyway, right? Look at that. There you go. Ooh, can I get away with one more hit? Yes, I can. We're good. Oof. Getting more and more stone-like, but ultimately we survived. Alright, let's go back and find Tomoyamo. I do feel just a little incomplete because I can't do the Divine Tablet thing. Slightly frustrating, but oh well, I guess. I got the information I needed. Man, this forest is big, though. And I'm still waiting to see how I can... Okay. Get through that one door that I have no idea how to open. Please actually hit this time. Yeah, oh, that's very good. One hit and this guy's out of here. And he missed with his attack? This is completely free. Bam, get out of here. That's what you gave for trying to pick a fight with me. Yeah, there's that door. I mean, I can go into that glowy entryway, but I can't do anything about the door that's behind it, unfortunately. Mild frustration. Okay, which way had I gone? Was this the way to the spider warp itself? No, not yet. Okay, I guess it was south of here. I think I was supposed to go west? Yeah, okay, I think we're good. Are you kidding me? The item that was here is no longer here. It was merging one, by the way, but it would have been nice to have it. That pisses me off. Guess it's just gone. I guess I should have refused to give him the thing he wanted before, because now I can't get the tablet that was here. That's annoying. Yeah, it's secret. He promised the forest god. Talk to Todoyamo. Oh, that's regular Yamo? Oh. Oh, if this is regular Yamo, then that means this might not be the area with the tablet after all. Maybe I'm good. Maybe I'm good then. Let's find out. Yeah, 
I think I want to go past this guy. Now we're getting toward that level up. That's right, I did have to go through here. Yeah, maybe this is what I want after all. Is merging one still here? No, we're good. I'm gonna ignore him this time. Keep it back? Oh, ah, look at that. The ring shine only when you wear it. Ah, well. Oh yes. Did you bring treasure? Ah, promise is promise. <laughs> I shall open the way to the caliban. But I also make promise to Elrum. I cannot take you there. If Elrum found that I told man, he would not be happy. Alright, fine. Let me play the game and get the stupid tablet. Got it. Alright, let's take a look. I still feel a little bit iffy about still having the divine tablet, though. Like, look at this. Oh well. Anyway. Merging one. The first minion absorbs the level and experience of the second. Same as when one of your minions defeats another. It's actually good to know. So you don't get a wrong... Like, like a wrong merge or something. Alright, I'm out of here. And I even get a save point, although I will go a little more than this. There we go. Oh, that's cool. Alright. This place is looking pretty cool. It's a whole new area of the forest. Oh, a snake type. Well, that's new to this area. Squamorge. What? And I don't have a fire type, so I'll settle for Arbitron. I'll go neutral on this guy. I don't know, I'll use water, I guess, and just see what happens. Ah, whatever. And it's also pretty whatever kind of damage. Oh well, slowly hack away. I don't know what that was all about. That build up. Arpertron's gonna need to take a little bit to heal after this. Ooh, I might not even kill him next turn. Unless I get lucky. No, alright, I made it. Another great walnut, you gotta be kidding me. And now we got a level 11 Arpatron. Great. Great. Oh, hello, it's just right in front of me. The opening of a bag can be seen among the weeds. Excellent liquor. Alright. Ooh, just missed him. All those guys still messing with me. What the hell? This is cool looking. This 
guy's still coming, too. But we do have a save point and a chest. Yellow bead, Kukumira oil, and Ichishi oil. Well, Ichi is one, right? And she? Is that death? Or am I reading too much into this? Uh, Kukumira oil increases defense. Increase magic defense. Alright. And what was the other thing? Oh, the yellow bead. Defense goes down a little bit, but magic defense slightly goes up and speed goes up even more. Good against Earth. That ain't bad. Why not? I'll give it a shot. Why not? I think I'm gonna have to fight the snake though. Oh, he's waiting for me. Alright, alright. Okay. Alright. Let's return. Ugh. Maybe I'll just run from this one. I mean, I know I should be leveling up, but like, come on. Ah, well, he is by himself, but nah. Because my, my one guy who's not level 11 is the element this guy is... Okay, <laughs> the element that's weak to this guy is what I was going to say. Or had intended to say. Is that anything? Uh, yes, okay. Skeleton key for me. What the hell? Whoa. Let me guess. Yeah, they stop moving if you look at them. That's actually creepy. What the hell are you? Embla? And I, the, the last thing I expected was them for to be water types. Uh, they're freaking trees. Of course they'd be earth, right? Shows what I know. Let's please use an earth attack. And then I'll use my foot attack just to see what happens. Or never mind. What if I just attack? That's not bad. It's over a third of his health. And that's something that I'm strong against, so I don't care. Or I don't know what that was. I have no idea what he did. Like, the, the arena's surrounded in something, but what? Uh, okay. Did he power himself up or what? Uh, who cares? You're dead now. Freaking dark root enemies. Yuck. You're damn right. Alright. I will fight one more enemy because I'm getting to... Not a point of no return, but a point of this is how it's gonna be for a while. 205 HP, not bad. Did he grow up? What if I just do all enemies just to see what happens? I guess one of them dodged it? Because I should have hit both of them. Ugh, again, I don't know what that is. Oh well, <laughs> you won't be doing that again. Although your friend might. Was that first attack something to lower my elemental defense or raise their elemental attack or what? I don't know, but they're they're gone now. Goodbye. That is a bunch of XP. I, I quite like that. Anyway, let's go. as well. Alright. I 
I think this beats the spider forest. Hello. Hey, 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 what, 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 what do you think you're doing? That echo. You have used talisman of imprisonment. So, you are agent of Gehenna. Beast of knowledge, minion of Gehenna. Thy mouth is cursed with bitterness. Thy hand is quick to spill blood. I have ruin and misery. Well, he's just out. Don't worry, this is in no way gonna cause trouble. Atonement for the flesh. Our mouths are cursed with bitterness. Our hands are quick to spill blood. Our path is ruin and misery. The Sacrifice. Jibara's men came and took Mother Garai away. Of course. Why? Why did they take her away? What do they mean by a sacrifice? What did you promise at the Hall of Judgment? No! I beg you, please save Mother Garai. Uh, we'll see where this goes. Also, can you heal me? What happened in the forest? Did you really imprison the Divine Tree? That trembling, the forest, it's weeping. We should prepare for the worst is right. What now? Th this is, I think, my last chance to heal for a little while. So definitely want to get on this right now, because I think this is going to be like... Like I said, not a point of no return, but a point of it'll be a while. Actually... You know what? Yeah, you know, this will be good for cash. Thanks. I'm out of here. See ya. I love how silly that is. Get to the Hall of Judgment! Now! I'm sure she's there! Please, hurry! I'll do what I can. Oh wow, it's dark. Uh, town shop, please. I gotta... do this while I can. Even inside is dark. What a troubling day it's been. Good heavens, what are you doing out so late at night? No chat, just shop. Sell. Lily Silk, that's a new one. Huh, Thunder Silk, so emits vague instantaneous flashes of light, sixth highest grade. Lily Silk, though, I've never seen this. Gives off a dazzling shine, fifth highest grade. Wow. No, not bad. Um, Ring of Stoning is quite valuable. Damn. Tendayoyaku, very nice. Oh yeah, what was excellent liquor? Because special was everything. 
Excellent is a lot. All right. Bye. Nope. You didn't know about the uproar tonight? I can't believe the usually quiet villagers could riot in the middle of the night. I wonder what happened. Yeah, about that. Anyway, real quick, blacksmith too. Because again, I think I'm going to be stuck for a little while. What are you up to at this hour? Surely you're not here to shop, are you? Uh, I mean, I am. Let's say weapon. Little bird's as good as it gets. Divine's as good as it gets. Oof. That is tempting. I, oof. The increase isn't radical, though. Ah, I'll, I'll buy one. I'm not going to ready it, though. You're crazy if you ask me. Oh! Father, a terrible Father. thing has happened. Oh, what oh. are you doing here? Garaya, the ritual of sacri 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 Yes, the ritual yeah. of sacrifice. Yeah, that's it. Hey, don't yeah, just stand there. It. Go now or you'll be too late. I'm sure you're worried I'm about sure Mabu, but I'll take care of her. You gotta go to the Hall of Judgment now. Yeah, like the game wasn't pushing me hard enough already. Let's go. If I could learn how to walk in a straight line. Can I just select it? Chief's Estate, I guess. Oh boy. It's like I'm playing a damn dungeon over here. Whoa, whoa. Do I pass this or do I go in that door? I guess I go in that door. Everyone's sleeping? Is the Hall of Judgment somewhere else? The hell is this? <laughs> I would have thought it would be in this general vicinity. Oh, the camera angle's changing, though. Alright, I'll read it. Halts, they're in the middle of an important ceremony. The Venerable Jabara has ordered that you must not pass. It's best for the village. Leave at once. Am I just gonna walk away? The Spinner of Souls. I shall ask you one final question. Why? Why did you come to Cyrus? I am not blind, you know. What were you scheming to do with that girl? I came here for this very day. I came to purify the souls of the Naki. No! Of all the beasts of knowledge. Still telling lies after all of this! You came to steal the souls of the people of Cyrus, is that not so? I've known it from the beginning, Mother Garai. Or should I call you by your real name? Azara, the goddess of death. Oh, if that's true, then oh man. Yes, indeed. You may call me that. I am the incarnation of the Divine Spirit, Azura. The one who spins new souls from the old. Now is the time when the lore of the beasts of knowledge shall be laid to waste. And the wisdom of the wise shall be rendered meaningless! Jibara. Ghost of foolish knowledge, Phantom of Gehenna. Some seek a sign, others desire knowledge. Such is the power of Elrum. But Elrum's foolishness is wiser than man. And Elrum's weakness is stronger than man. Light and darkness the two souls. Chosen ones of light and darkness shall lead this accursed state to eternal rest. 
for the two spin our souls and lead us to the promised land. The time of gathering is at hand. Our souls become one with the chosen. Oh, what a twist. Where's your sacrifice now? I'm still arguing with a guy. I can't even check him. Do not mess with my mother-in-law. Damn. Got us at death. Thank God she's on my side. Wow. Who was that? Was that the blacksmith's son trying to come to Mabu? She's not even here. I thought she would be turned to stone, silk, whatever that was. But there is this. Moth Key, the fourth forest. It's just here. I guess Garai left it because that's where she said. I wonder why I wasn't affected. Could it have been the ring? Or the fact that I'm the cocoon master? So this is the time of gathering that Mother Garai spoke of. I did not expect this. I knew I couldn't talk to her for a while for healing purposes, but damn. I had this feeling that Mother Garai's spirit shot right through me a moment ago. Yeah, y you notice anything different about yourself? All kinds of things went through my mind at once, and before I knew it, this is what happened to me. All the villagers' souls went with Mother Garai to the place of Elrum. Your father's disappearance, the wrath of the Onibubu, the sacrifice? It was all... all for this day. Ni, the Nagi chieftain, knows all truth. That's what Mother Garai said before she departed. And remember, the Nagi is... who, like, who Mabu is and where she's from. There's the Nagi village that... Apparently our village doesn't even know how to get to. Tradition, fate, curses, demons. We we are bound by so many chains. But those chains, they are also what have bound our hearts. They are what make us ourselves. Ugh, I feel so weak. I may not be able to stay like this much longer. You speak the truth. Your soul shall at last become one with the will of the forest. And the flesh shall be lost. Staying inside a cocoon can prolong your life. But only until the transformation completes. There is little time left. Leave the rest to me. Mabu, you must stay in the cocoon. Is this going to be why it's called Jade Cocoon? Because she has a green one? Because we've been doing cocoons this whole game, but they have not been green. Mabu's Cocoon. Guess I won't be healing or merging monsters for a while, which is another reason I went to town uh, the last installment. Well then, you probably know not what has happened. Our souls now wander through space and time, seeking new bodies. And a new ordeal shall begin when our souls return to the flesh. 
The brilliance of the ring Mabu gave you is proof that you are the chosen one of light. The chosen one of darkness is waiting for you beyond this dimension. I don't know if I'm ready for that. The path to him shall test your devotion. It shall be a journey of the heart. Is that the weird annoying guy in my dream, maybe? The outcome shall form the ordeal that our souls await. Go to the Moth Forest. There you must seek out the Nagi Chieftain at the Temple of Kemuel. Before you go, don the coat of Regents. It is my final gift to you. I wish you luck. The Chosen One. I got the garb. I wonder if it's better than my best armor at the blacksmith. But there we go. So this is why things can get a little scary now. If I'm going to heal minions, I have to keep winning battles. So I suppose I could leave a forest and enter like the dragonfly forest and kill a couple really weak enemies. But I'm not going to Mabo to heal. If I'm going to heal in difficult times, I must use items. So... And again, I can't merge minions, so this is going to be scary for a little while. I can warp to any forest I'd like, beetle or dragonfly, for that matter. I could have an even easier attempt than beetle forest. But, yeah, moth is going to be where I have to go, at least to advance the story. So this is how it's going to be for a little while. Before I open the moth forest, I am going to save. And apparently when I beat the Moth Forest, that actually will be a point of no return. So I'm going to be, uh, or I'm going to want to be, extra careful with that business. But. For now, it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We cleared the Spider Forest, and oh man, a lot of stuff went down. Mother Garai was the goddess of death, and she hit the whole town with an effect that seems like it froze people, maybe made them into cocoons, or took their spirits to the the all-encompassing time and space where nature, the essence of nature is, and Mabu herself turned into a fairy or a butterfly creature and then went into a cocoon, and we have it now. A lot's going on. And we are going to have to go to the Moth Forest and see whatever's on the other side. We gotta see the Nagi Chieftain, so perhaps the Nagi Village is through the Moth Forest. It would make sense if Mother Garai had the key. Boy oh boy, do we have a mission to take care of. Until next time, everyone.